everybody. So it's Friday morning and I weigh in on Friday mornings and from last week to this week, I am down a pound. Um, as you know, I just started back on my health journey. I had gotten off track and this week I had a really successful week, Monday through Friday. Uh, last weekend we had gone to the lake and spent some vacation time down there. So I kind of uh, didn't track over the weekend and late last week, but all of this week I've tracked, I've stayed within my points. Um, I started my Optavia fueling journey this week, so I felt like um, it was a really successful week for me. So I'm down a pound, so I'm excited about that. I'm headed in the right direction again. So I'm gonna insert several clips in here kind of to show you uh, what I did this week and give you a little um, peek into what these fuelings are about, how they compare to Weight Watchers. So stick around and I'm gonna show you what I ate this week as well as my nightly dinners called Lean and Greens. So here we go. I just got home and James uh, brought in the delivery from Optavia. So those are our fuelings for a month for both of us. So I'm excited to go through this tonight and show you what we got. Okay, you can see I got four different kinds of crunchers and um, poppers. Those are kind of like the crispy, crunchy snacks. Um, I received several boxes of the buttermilk cheddar herb biscuit. And then for some reason, they sent me five boxes of the hearty red bean and vegetable chili. I ordered one, so I think they subbed out something I didn't receive for this chili, so I hope the chili's good, because James wanted it. Um, got a box of the chicken noodle soup. Um, then I didn't order this pasta. I ordered, ordered another one, so I'm guessing that they subbed this one out. Um, it's the spinach pesto mac and cheese. So we'll give that a shot. These are these savory ones really James wants for lunch. And then a cheesy buttermilk cheddar mac. We got one of those to try. So those are kind of our hearty types of things that we're gonna be having. And then here are the three shakes we're gonna try. A chocolate one, a vanilla one, and strawberry. And then starting down here on the bars, you can see I got the, we heard a lot about these chocolate um, mint cookie crisp bars. We got several of those. The dark chocolate coconut, caramel delight, uh, a peanut butter chocolate chip, and then a zesty lemon. So those are the main bar choices. And then this is the big dessert, the brownie that everybody talks about. We got several boxes of these. And then kind of breakfasty, um, a frosted cinnamon spice crisp bar, a cranberry honey nut granola bar, and then a couple boxes of these chocolate chip pancake mixes. So, 30 days worth of fueling. So these will be all the meals we're gonna be having um, throughout the day and in the evening for snacks, other than the one lean and green meal that I'll be making. Okay, so now that I got my Optavia order in, I'm gonna try out my first fueling. This is the honey mustard and onion sticks, so like a uh, stick. And I did scan these into Weight Watchers just now, and they scan for three points on the green plan. And, and they are like 100 calories. So this is kind of what they look like. That one's stuck together. Good. They're good. It's just like a little pretzel snack. Let me get the box. So, 100 calories, one and a half grams of fat, 13 carbs, total carbs, but of those total carbs, five, five of that is fiber, and then protein, 11 grams. So, they're good. They're really good. Just some nice little 
snack, only three Weight Watchers points. So that's really good. For my lean and green meals this week, I'm gonna keep it pretty simple. We're gonna do some um, grilled meat. Um, tonight we're gonna to have some Amy Lou chicken sausages on the grill, and then I'm just gonna do a salad. So I went ahead and chopped up for the week um, some cucumbers, some tomatoes, some scallions, and then I bought this big thing of baby spring mix and some light ranch. This is my lean ingredient. I've got five ounces of the Amy Lou chicken sausage on there, two tablespoons of the Olive Garden light Italian dressing, and then my three vegetables. One of them is the spring mix. The other one is half a, um, of the scallions, and then half of the tomato serving, and then a serving of the English cucumbers. Getting ready to try my golden chocolate chip pancakes. I have a couple mini dash um, waffle makers, so I'm gonna use those to make two. I went ahead and put four tablespoons of water in the mix, and then I'll have a little bit of that sugar-free maple syrup. They made two chocolate chip waffles, um, and my sugar-free syrup is gonna be one of my condiments. And so when I put this into Weight Watchers, it is three Weight Watchers points on the green plan. These chocolate chip pancakes are really good. Really good. Okay, had to run to the dentist's office, so I'm a little bit late on my fueling because I was in the dentist's office, so about 30 minutes behind, but I'm gonna do the Silky peanut butter and chocolate chip bar and I just ran this through Weight Watchers and it is three Weight Watchers points on the green plan It's a really soft bar soft and chewy Peanut butter and chocolate chip. It's it's very good. You gotta like peanut butter, I'm gonna do. <laughs> it's good. So I am stuck waiting for the DMV so I can change my driver's license to Kansas. And so sitting in the car waiting um, for my appointment time. So I grabbed um, an Optavia Smoky Barbecue Crunchers to try today for this fueling since I'm in the car. Mm. They're kind of like Cheetos, but these are kind of like a barbecue flavor. flavor. Kind of like those crunchy Cheetos. Pretty good. Okay, so it's time for another fueling. So I picked the creamy vanilla shake and I got me one of these magic bullets. And so I put in half a cup of water, half a cup of ice to try it. And it measures out um, three Weight Watchers points on the green plan. That's really good. It's like a vanilla shake. It's delicious. It's really good. Mm. I'm glad I bought a couple boxes of those. My lean and green tonight is six ounces of grilled hamburger and then this salad. Tonight for my lean and green, I'm having six ounces of grilled chicken breasts with sugar-free barbecue sauce and my salad with light ranch dressing. I'm really interested to see how the points with Weight Watchers um, compare. So this is a, one of the days. So I had total of five fuelings and one lean and green on this day. And it ended up being a total of 21 Weight Watchers green points. So 
I'm eating every two to three hours. So basically my breakfast scanned in for a total of six points, the lunch five, and then between dinner and then my last few end of the day, it was 10 Weight Watchers points. So today I'm trying the buttermilk cheddar herb biscuit. And I just put it in the microwave for a minute and mixed it up with three tablespoons of water. And then I took a Laughing Cow Cheese Wedge and smeared over the top of it and put it back in the microwave for about 15 seconds. Scanned it um, on Weight Watchers. So for Weight Watchers, it's three points on the green plan for the biscuit and then one for the Laughing Cow Cheese. So four total on Weight Watchers Green. Um, very, very delicious. This is a great fueling. Okay, I figured out how to do the chili. Um, I think James had trouble with this one yesterday because it exploded in the microwave on him, but here's how I did it. So I took the chili mix and put it with eight tablespoons of water about two and a half hours ago. And I put it in the microwave with this lid on it. Um, and I had the vent up, but I put that on in the microwave for two minutes, took it out, stirred it, um, plopped the lid back down, the vent back down, and just let it set on my counter for two and a half hours um, until it was time for my next fueling. So it's time for my next fueling right now. So I just um, took this out, um, opened it back up, and it's nice and thick. And so it was cold by then, so I needed to thicken it, um, warm it back up. So I again put this lid on it, put the seal up in the microwave, um, microwave it for another two minutes, put the lid back down, brought it to my desk, let it set for about a minute, and I opened it back up. And now it looks like to me it's the perfect consistency and it's the right temperature to eat. So it's going to be great. I've already tasted it. it tastes great. Uh, beans are pretty firm, but they're not hard. Um, so anyway, I think it, it's good. Um, I tracked it in my Weight Watchers app and it's three Weight Watchers points. But I like the consistency and this was made with eight tablespoons of water. Um, but again, I let it sit for almost three hours. Eating my lean and green pretty early tonight. It's just now 4:30, but I am home for work, hungry. I want to say two. I want to save two of my fuelings for tonight in the evening. So I'm gonna just do some leftover chicken breast, six ounces, on top of a bed of lettuce with some tomato, green onions, cucumbers, and then a couple of tablespoons of light Italian dressing.